Hub started to start using HipChat in the fall of 2011, and we started using it to solve IM sprawl. Every department was able to use whatever client and or server between Java, Pigeon, Adium, and we looked at HipChat to really solve that centrally where teams could collaborate across teams. We use HipChat all day, every day. We use it to communicate with other team members on the product team. We use it to communicate with other members in other teams, like support, sales, marketing. To collaborate across teams and to keep making progress while people are in a focus mode. We truly allow real-time opt-in group collaboration through it. At the core of HubSpot's culture is really transparency. We believe in hiring great people and giving them all the tools and information they need to succeed. So HipChat helps us with that mission because it can make communicating with everyone really, really easy and really fast. And we're so time and metric driven, information can be shared within seconds and responded to as fast. My favorite features of HipChat are the, uh, the file history and the chat history. Uh, often people ping us from all over the company and it's nice to have that context to get you refreshed, bring you up to speed. And we have a lot of fun with it too. We have our own custom emoticons. We have the company logo, our sprocket, and we have our chief product officer, David Cancel's head spinning around when you type ship it. We have a hip chat bot that actually interacts with the entire team. We just address it in any public chat room or you can instant message with him directly and you can just give him little commands. So if you want to run an image search for hot dogs, you can go, Worcester, image me a hot dog or making funny meme pictures or grabbing pictures of cats with cash. We love Second Street Cafe. It's a great little haunt here in Cambridge. And every single day they have uh, lunch specials, which are different. And so rather than running off to the website all the time, we can just have our chatbot tell us what's for lunch. We love all the different clients. We love the desktop client and also the mobile client so that we can stay in touch with people if they're outside of the office. And it keeps state. So often people rely on email to keep files or to keep track of a thread, but you've got that in HipChat. And in fact, um, it's really easy to use on the mobile phone. It's really easy to use from a web browser. So it's, it's available anywhere that your email is. I'd recommend a company starts with HipChat either when they first get going or at any time they're having issues with real-time communication and feedback.